Hey guys, come on in. Well, we met at St. John's. That's where it started, in the women's basketball office. I'm so excited I got my first opportunity to be on a coaching staff. So I get to St. John's and I'm going to be the GA. So I come in, I'm all fired up, I can't wait. It's going to be like the greatest thing that's ever happened. And then of course I was given the initial job of giving him the campus tour, like within minutes of him walking through the door. And obviously you know just from the job you spend a lot of time with people. So whether you want to get to know them really well or not, you do. So you know it, it certainly started as a friendship and an easy friendship. After getting to know my wife over time, um, you know, I think that's when, you know, I started to understand kind of where my feelings were, my emotions were about her. And here we are, baby number four. <laughs> Balancing being a coach and a parent, it's ever changing at this point because we went from no kids to one to two to three and now four whether you're coaching basketball, football, baseball, whatever it is, a college sport in general, you're missing time with your kids somewhere, whether it's a sporting event, something for school. So for them to be on the road, you know, it's great to be able to share that with them. It's great to be able to share them with that, you know, at games where we're like now Brady, who's, who's about to be nine, is... Uh, giving me his analysis after the game, <laughs> and he knows all the players, and even JJ now at, at five is still is doing that now too. So um, now that they're really into it, they know what's going on. It's a lot of fun because you get to hear their take on the game. Last week at my son's basketball game, they asked me if this was the baby's first basketball game, and I'm like, man, this baby, she's been to JMU, she's been to UNLV, she's been to Butler, she's been to Xavier. Um, and they were like, what, you know? You get to have them with you sharing those, you know, moments of success and, and during the difficult times. You know, when we won the Big East in 16, to be able to look in the stands and they were there, that was like, that's a big moment. Like, if they weren't there, it probably wouldn't have been as, as whole of an experience. Even, like, the road games and, like, the traveling, you know, I, I love being there. Like, I love being a part of that, and I think the kids love it, and they, they're just used to it. For them, it's not like they're at... A, a special event or anything special, it's just part of, of life for them, they're, they're used to that. They have the ability to be married to someone and, and loved by someone who is part of and understands what you do is you don't get that often. So well, there's an understanding of probably what I'm dealing with on a daily basis more than it would be with someone who, who hadn't been in the business or didn't understand what you're going through on a daily basis. So couldn't be more fortunate to, uh, to be with someone who does understand that.